Well, that's the thing, Dan. We're still waiting on the decision as to whether or not City Council plans to pass this new ordinance. Now, of course, there is no answer to solving the homelessness issue, of course, as we've seen all over the state. But according to some of the people that we've talked to tonight, they say that this ban is not a solution. As wet weather rolls in, some are worried about the people without a roof over their heads. And I probably walked by 30 other homeless people that I could recognize. And hypothermia is no joke. You can die. And there's a real lack of humanity. But it's a fine line for Santa Cruz City Council members as they are working to find a solution for homelessness. We hope that we do strike a balance between um, allowing homeless individuals to get some rest in the evening and um, allowing the, pub the rest of the public to enjoy public space in the daytime. The proposed solution, amending a city ordinance that would prohibit homeless from camping between 10 p.m. and 7 a.m. There is a caveat though. If there isn't enough shelter space available, then they would be able to camp, but would have to vacate the campsite at seven in the morning. I was almost for seven years and in all honesty, by pushing people away from businesses and residents, all they're doing is pushing them in a big circle. And it is true as the city has shut down big camps, small encampments have popped up across Santa Cruz. Residents like Lee Labrie want the city to do something. She says even a trip to visit her late husband is often rudely interrupted. The way and at the cemetery, my girls visiting his grave were, were cat called and I've been yelled at. And it's not that we're anti homeless. We, we just want to be able to visit my husband and their dad in a, like a really nice way so I can tell him what's going on and what he's missing and how much we miss him. Now, if this ordinance does pass tonight, this is just one of a two-step process. It will have to pass another vote at the next meeting before it can fully go into effect. Dan? All right. Thank you, Kyla.